Hey, what's up everybody? This is Louis from Infinitive Solutions, IG at Infinitive Solutions. And we're gonna be doing a system startup right on that American Standard heat pump. As the system is getting ready to be stable, uh, we're gonna be trying out some new gadgets that I got. As some of you know or seen, I like using the Testo probes. I really like them, they're very convenient. But from the beginning I had one issue and it was refrigerant loss. Refrigerant loss when I was attaching them and refrigerant loss when I was detaching them. And to be honest with you, sometimes I was very skeptical about using them just because of that. You know, a lot of times they tell you, don't put your gauges on it, don't put your gauges on it because whatever refrigerant is gonna go in the lines, in your hoses, it might be enough to set off the charge. So when the probes came out, I was like, boy, that's, that's freaking awesome, let's, let's rock them. And as I started using the probes, I was like, oh crap. Maybe this is not such a good idea until these bad boys came around. So I don't know how to pronounce the brand. It's W E H wet, or I would say we. So these are some kick ass fittings. I saw them online from other um, IG accounts that do HVAC. And I think they became very popular back on the, on the trade shows from last year or early this year. So. This is, they come in a package, you buy your high side, you buy your low side. They also have the mini split style, so they have a bigger fitting, not a 3 8 I think it's a 5 16 for the mini splits. But my take on this is you attach your probe at the back and then these will literally just slap in into your uh, access port on the units. So they look pretty freaking nice, pretty cool built. Um, I'll be giving them a try for the first time, so this is not, there's no practice. This will be the first time. If I fail, you're gonna watch me fail. If I, if I succeed, then hey. All right, so before I actually go and put them on the unit, I'm just trying to like see how this works, how the mechanism works, and um, you can see that it expands so I guess it would allow you to go into the into the port and then once it's all in all the way it will lock in place and then in the back you would just screw your port your probes or whatever you're gonna use right on so <laughs> I'm not gonna lie man I'm a little nervous to try them out cuz I mean we had the perfect charge at least we weighed it in and I'm afraid I'm gonna lose it or if I'm gonna attempt this, I might lose some, but hey, you gotta learn one way or the other, right? So here it goes. All right, so here it goes. Moment of truth. Um, I'm just gonna go for it, give it a try and see what happens. Holy crap. I guess that's it. So here we are. I've been practicing on and off, trying to figure out how to get it on and off. So I guess here's a an experienced user by now. <laughs> After a couple of tries. This thing is sweet. Check it out. Slap, turn, boom, you're on. Zero refrigerant loss. Now to back it out, simple. Turn it again. When you're ready to pull, just pull. Bam, all said and done.